Into the Jungle is the story of a young woman who falls in love with a Bolivian man. She's a foster child. She's had a very troubled past and moves to his very, very remote jungle village uh, because a jaguar has killed his nephew and he's a, he's a jaguar hunter. Instead of running away from home all the time, which she's finally in a place she can't run away from, she has to stay in this jungle and grow up. I was fascinated by a friend. This was actually her story. She met a man, uh, she, she was a foster child, uh, through a series of foster families. She was brought down to South America. She became fluent in Spanish. Um, and she was 16 years old. She, she met a man in Cochabamba and fell in love with him. And he went back to his jungle village and asked her to come. And when you're young and in love, you say yes. And so I thought that was the basis for a wonderful story. I'm a believer in going to the place to do the research. There's only so much I can feel from what I read or stream or whatever, I need to go there. So to research into the jungle, I went to the Peruvian Amazon for a month. I wanted to have that sort of isolation for my character, Lily, because for her whole life, she had been running away from growing up. I felt like if I put her there, she has to learn, considering she's 19 years old. I really had to go back and remember how I felt as a 19-year-old, and I was a very young 19-year-old. I left my home, I went to Europe, I was kind of a, a lost person there for a couple of years. I mean, I, was, I would be the kind of person that if someone said they were madly in love with me, but I can only be with them if I go with them to the jungle, I would be fine. I'll go to hell and back for you, you know? So I was that kind of person. Riding into the jungle has just really made me fall in love with the place, fall in love with the people. I'm filled with wonder when I think about the animals there, the plants there, the interdependency of life there. I am so happy I got the chance to experience this for myself, and I'm so excited that as readers, you will get the chance to see, feel, hear, smell the Amazon, hopefully through my words and through this book.